chose to not give you any cheeks or affection is because you're just too good for her, man. You're better than her. You make her feel funny. you wondering why you can't get a girl you're attractive and all that stuff. It's because when you talk, you're talking with too much sense. You know what I'm saying? You're too genuine. You're, 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 motive, you're, you're giving off the, the boyfriend vibe. You're giving off that you want a relationship. You're giving off the relationship vibe too much. They don't like when you already know what you want. They, they like when you... They like when you seem untamed, when you seem off a leash, when you seem like you just enjoying yourself, enjoying the single life. That's when they want to take you away from that single life. And the first thing they do is go straight in your pants and whip it out and boop, boop. They're trying to, I got to get your attention. They're trying to get your attention fast because they feel like you just, you could be anywhere at any time. But if you seem, if they know you're focused on them, they know you know what you want. You're texting back fast. You're setting dates up. They know you set you you setting dates up and uh, you know you look. They saying you planning stuff ahead of time after the first date and they saying oh he want to be around me. He like me. He want he know what he want. They say you and they feel like your mind is already made up to date the one. They don't want you. I don't care how good you look. Now if you got a lot of money. They're going to deal with you, but the respect ain't going to be as high as it was if they felt that you was, uh, if you wasn't, if you was slippery, if you wasn't in their hands. So the problem comes, I know it sounds crazy, but they don't really want, they don't want a man to know what he want. That's given all that, all that energy and visual cerebral on them. They don't want that. They don't want it. They want that dude that can cheat at any moment. They want that dude that is a cheater. They just want to find him. They, want to, they just want to catch him. They want that dude that is a cheater. They know your heart. They have women's intuition. And to, in their mind, he's wanted. They want somebody that's already wanted. They don't want your clean hand bone. They want dirty hand bone between your legs. They don't want it to be clean. They don't want you to be getting that. Yeah, they say that, but they say everything. They say they're not going to get back with their ex. They say this and that. They kept getting back with him. Why? He was cheating. He gave them an STD. And they still, they're attracted to dirty hand bone. Your hand bone too clean, bro. You know what I mean when I say hand bone. Willy Wonka between your legs. Yeah. That's why, man. They're not complaining about guys like you. That's why you ain't getting no cheeks. You got muscles. You flat stomach. You're strong. 6'5", 6'6", 6'8". They don't appreciate you, man. Not in most of them. Now, God may send you some. But the, the reason why you're complaining is because they don't appreciate you because you're available. They want you to be emotionally unavailable. When you're emotionally unavailable, you're a turn on because they, you're turning them on because the fact that you're turned off, you're not even on. So they feel like in order to turn you on, they have to turn you on. You're emotionally unavailable. You're only concerned about your, when, you, when you're only concerned about your material things, uh, something superficial, yourself, you gotta give off selfish, display selfish behavior. And it's not verbally. It's in your your demeanor. It's, it's in your demeanor. So you got to understand that because a lot of times, you, a lot of you guys, y'all be hitting me up saying, what's going on with it? Y'all, y'all great guys. Ain't nothing wrong with you. You just ain't got nobody else. So she feel all the attention going to her. You ain't got nobody else. If you had a girl, most of these women are attracted to guys that have, that's already in a situation. They already in a, they already have a, a woman. They like the energy of taking you from somebody else. They like, they can feel that another woman is in your life. Your, your, your demeanor is too smooth. You're too hung. You, you, your hesitation is there. You ain't quick to tell them, come over my house. So they say, you must got somebody he living with. You see what I'm saying? They can pinpoint all that. 
When you ain't got nobody, ain't like, what you doing after this? You want to come over? You know what I'm saying? That's how you are. You want to come over? You want to do this? You want to do that? They know you ain't got nobody. They know you ain't got nobody. They like, they attracted the guys that's already in relationships. Either have a lot of women or have a woman or both. They don't want you if you know, they don't care how good you look. Why are you single? They gonna ask you that. Why are you single? Cause the reason why they gonna ask you that is because you, you too genuine. Something ain't right for you to be single. They don't respect you. Something ain't right. For you to be this attractive and tall and well, something ain't right for you to be single. Cause if if nobody else wants you, I don't want you either. But if I can sense that a woman is in your life, then I want you. I know it sounds crazy, man. You gotta be immature, man. You can't be a mature dude, though. Why you think kids, the little boys get molested so much, man? Because they be the women attracted to untameness, man. And women are attracted to childlike behavior. But the behavior, not the talk, but the behavior. They can read your behavior. They see two different things that you see. You see this, and they see that. They looking at your actions, man. How quick are you to walk away? How many times you not calling? You know, they notice that you don't call all the time. They notice that you you seem happy. You don't even when you you don't ask them questions. You know, they they know they can feel. They know when you want a relationship, when you want to claim them. That's not what they want. They want a guy who don't want to claim them. And well, that's why most of them are single. Yeah, they get worn out and they end up belonging to the streets by seeking a man. They're trying to convert a man that's already taken, already emotionally unavailable. Trying to convert him into being available makes them run out all their youthful years and, and blow out their vaginal hole till they get loose. Look like a cur meat curtain doors. It's blown out. The best years of their life is getting taken by dudes that's married, dudes that's in relationships. They blowing them out. <laughs> That's what they getting. You want to be that guy that work hard and end up with one of them when they 30, 35, they got one or two or three, four kids by a dude or several dudes. And they saying, yeah, that was my, that's my past, but I learned. Anyway, I like you and I want to be all about you. You getting the leftover version of them. You're not getting the young, vibrant nipple version of them. Their nipples gone. By the time you get them, their nipples are gone. By the time you get them, the nipple's going to be gone. You hear that? So you got to ask yourself. That's why she don't want you, bro. She'll take a guy that's look worse than you, that's shorter than you. If you come across as if you're not needy, you're emotionally unavailable. You don't need them. But if you need them, you ain't gonna get no hugs. You can get a little friendly, barely want to touch you hug. You might look better. The dude, she's all over is because he's he got a wife, he got a girlfriend. He's his demeanor is like he emotionally unavailable. So she she gotta go hard. She gotta go get. She gotta go hard. Her her sexual energy is way up there because she got to. But if she already got your attention, she ain't gonna get you no. They ain't gonna give up. It's, <clears throat> if they don't gotta give up the cheeks, they ain't giving up the cheeks. They only give it up when they really, really just got off their period. You know what I'm saying? Or really, really in the mood. And they just got off their period, or they gotta really have someone just because you done did so much, let me give you some courtesy. But in, in order to bring the monster out of them in the bedroom, you gotta be emotionally unavailable. You gotta be a tease. They got to feel like, what what can I do to get his attention? That's what they doing. 
That's what they trying to figure out. What can they do? What can they do to get your attention? But if they already got it, you ain't gonna get none. Y'all know who I am. I'm Alan Williams, three in there. A W R. Hold on. A W T R. Much love, y'all. Hey, I'll holler at y'all back. Subscribe to all my pages on Instagram and YouTube. You can start off with subscribing to this page, but I got a lot of pages, so when you see them, hit that, hit that subscribe button. I'll holler at y'all in a little bit.